working in science or technology. Gardner Twilly had uh, sent us a letter and he said that the birds have scared away all of the worms in the soil and the soil is lacking nutrients and his plants are dying and he can't plant any more plants until his soil gets better. So he asked our second graders to design and create something that he could use in his garden to help his uh, soil get better. We read a whole bunch about worms. We also have a worm factory composter in our classroom. So we're learning about how worms compost. So after learning about their bodies and what their, the worm bodies do and how important they are to the soil, we, uh, the kids have been able to design and create something that will do the same thing as a worm. And mine is a camera that has a digging device on it that helps it dig. And it's used for robot worms and real worms. This part is the water and this is the sunshine. And it's like a vacuum, you just put it in your flower garden and it uh, waters the seeds. Farmer Twelly, the birds ate the worms and scared them off, but now he has no more worms. And and now we have to make worms for him that work just like the real worms. I'm making a worm that looks just like it, but we have to make nutrients that that will help the dirt too, but we don't know. Yesterday we were stumped, but we worked together to help us. What have you learned about worms? What do you remember? Um, that they um can compost, and they um their caffeines are very special and gross.